Hello, this is Torio, and welcome back to Let's Play Europa Universalis Force Catholic Ottomans. And yeah, we are fighting a bunch of people, Delhi, Persia and Kazakh. Mm, it is weird that all those countries haven't formed coalitions against me. And now, not much is happening in Europe, because I am waiting for my heir to actually be eligible to become the Emperor. Mm, I don't need to increase my legit legitimacy this way anymore. Okay, our guys have gathered here. Once the good general comes, I'll probably... I suppose I could attack this army right now, but I'll wait for the good general. Where are you going? Just running back and forth. Because they do have an awesome general, I would probably need this good one to not suffer too many losses. I mean, we would win anyway with our superior numbers, but... Uh, yeah, why risk anything? So, detach a siege here. And you're going to Mogostan. Can I cut you there? Persia occupied Ormia. Well, doesn't matter. Mm, they will arrive in Ban on 21st, I will arrive on 28th. Okay, so let's go to Ban. This is mountains. Oh crap, we're attacking into the mountains. No, 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 don't. Uh, too late. Shit. Never mind, we'll win. Oh, they went away. Wonderful. Let's chase them. At least we're not attacking into the mountains. Chase them. Wherever you go, I will be... Oh, they're attacking me and Ma and Merv. That won't go well for you. Because my awesome armies are on your trail. Oh, they want this. Well, that is an awesome general. But uh, we are about to crush them. Might even get a wipe because they have lower morale after what happened recently. Yes. Good. Wipe. Wonderful. Okay. Let's go to forts. Uh, resettlement. That's the what plantation again. I don't really care about those plantations. Um, I will forbi forbid the trade company driving out local population. Yeah, let's be good. Trade companies, bad. Us, good. Mm, can I add any terrain? I can. And this. And that will be it, I think, yeah. Uh, still no bonus merchants. How close are we to... Oh, bloody hell, what happened? Hmm. The recording broke for some reason, but um, yeah, we're back in action. So what uh, was, what was I supposed to do? Yeah, just wait for the sieges, I suppose. Mm, how are we doing on Kazak? Oh, wait a minute. What are you guys doing here? Occupied by Georgia, I can't let you do that. This is my territory. At least they won't be able to take anything because I control all the forts. Okay, the fort has been retaken, which means I can advance to their capital. Oh, this is taken as well. Uh, okay, go here. Uh, Palatinate has been re-elected. How old are you? 19 and no heir. Interesting. Why are you voting for the Palatinate all the time? I have no idea. Well, at least they do have some imperial authority. They won't be able to pass a reform, but, um, yeah. I don't think they will, at least. Because uh, the authority is declining. All right, this is finished as well. Just go around sieging normal provinces now. And same here. Are you sieging this? You are sieging this. I don't want you to. Maybe I should just leave this alone for now. I think we have... Um, yeah, the stuff we have claims on or is already sieged by us. Also, I have free diplomats that, sh that I should be using. Okay, let's sort this by peace deal cost. 
in Diplo points. That's too much war score. That is, in fact, too much war score. Uh, I suppose I could res. Mm, I could. Alright, let's not take this one. And I think that will be the end of our war. Oh, crap, crap, crap. This is the one that I don't want. Yeah, it will screw everything. Oh, mm, screw everything up. That's better. I don't want a connection because she planned, hey. Um, where were we? Alright, I was supposed to check if I have zero overextension. Yes, so we can finally sign the peace treaty. 97, zero diplo. Great. Here we go, more expansion. And we can cover everything, because we do have the points. Um, how are we doing on unrest? Let me see through the autonomy map mode. Mm, not much unrest here. Well, there is a bit up in Kazakh. Uh, might be problematic later, but for now we're fine. Okay. And now it is time to collect our forces. I suppose I could leave some in Europe. Hmm. Should I leave them in Europe or should I move them to Asia for faster conquest of everything? Well, I do not intend to attack anyone in Europe in the near future. I suppose I could attack Poland, but still. Hmm. Union still not stable enough, and... Oh, that's... That's not a lot of inheritance chances. Still no level 3 Diplorep guy. Might go for the level 2 one. And next level. Yay. We're beelining it for level 23. Or was it 22? It says 23, but I think I got Imperialism in 22 last time I played. Mm, right. Yeah, let's get all the armies to Asia. <clears throat> Who is our next target? Probably Yarkand. Yarkand is allied with Bengal. Bengal being this tiny guy over here. Okay, mm let's conquer them as well. Well, I could, I could attack Mongyang, I suppose. Fabricate some claims. Yarkand next. Mm, there's still a lot of fabrication to do with Yarkand. And rivals, Tuscany. Tuscany is back to being eligible to be my rival for some reason. Okay, you guys. Hmm. We will be attacking Yarkand next, right? So, should probably distribute you next to their borders. Wait a minute, why is this army so small? Where are you? Alright, you're the one, the two, the two armies that should be together. Uh, okay, you go here. And the rest, and the rest, I will just um, distribute all the provinces on the borders of Yarkand. That should work. Um, yeah, you as well. Just go north or something. Uh, lost conquest Casas Belly against Delhi. Well, we will, we will fabricate more claims. Should probably improve relations with uh, Great Britain and Portugal in the near future, especially Portugal, because they might become an enemy if I don't. Hmm. Well, they already do have enough rivals. Uh, yeah, let's focus on fabricating instead. Vajanagar. This will be a succession. No. Right. When will you die? My awful, awful ruler that I can't do anything about. Yeah, let's fish for some more level 3 guy. Guys. Alright, the recording keeps breaking for some reason. I'll try to figure it out between episodes. For now, I'll just, uh, you know, redo it every time. 91% overextended. Mm, yeah, all you guys are walking somewhere? No, not all of you. In, all right, they were black flagged, so they couldn't continue. You'll go there, and you'll go over here. And it'll be fine. I suppose I could tr start looking for a way to fight Ryazan. 
Okay, and in December we'll see how likely we are um, to inherit Lithuania. Hmm. Should probably focus on the Diplomat Advisor for now. Yeah, I really need that level 3. I need the points and I need a diplomatic reputation for inheritance. Maybe I should enact... Um, I suppose I could enact a policy to increase my diplomatic reputation for military points. Yeah, let's do that. Military points are not that crucial. I could also get it for diplo points, but that's more... That's more problematic. And now my inheritance chance has gone up to 12%. Well, there is a chance. Okay, they're taking a little bit of attrition, but it's not a big problem. And yeah, paper points are being gained in an, at an enormous rate. Okay. Some course. Yeah, right. I really, really wish there was an automatically convert checkbox. Okay. A claim on Bengal has been completed. I don't think we can fabricate any new ones. No. Hmm. But we can fabricate another one in Yarkand. And I will keep doing it. Till we can do it no more. In the meantime, hmm. Vajagan, Vajrayanagar and Orissa. Just everything we can. Mm, what else? I mean, we will fight Delhi again. But we already have a claim on this, this guy over here. Might go for... Mm, Kazakh or Delhi. It's the same truce, I suppose. Doesn't really matter that much. And the truce of Persia is very long as well. Didn't take too much from them. Maybe I should have cancelled their alliance. I mean, this war was pretty convenient. Let's fabricate on Delhi. I do need all that, all that land after all. But I do not, do not need those forts active. At the moment. Yeah, cancel all this. And, you know what, I should probably just destroy them. This one we might need, this one we won't need. Same with um, those guys. Yeah, they're taking my money for no reason. They're in the middle of, of my territory, I don't need those forts. Anything else? This one. Don't need it. And here. Okay, that's much better. We should be getting richer soon. Also, Lithuania is my subject, so I don't really need the fort on the Lithuanian border. Mm, and that will be it, mostly. I should improve relations with my allies and subjects. But I've been fabricating all the time, so I don't have the time to do that. Hmm. Okay, then. All Diplo points go towards technology now. And pause. I could attack Yarkon, but how many claims do I have against them? Only a couple. I could use more before I attack. Really, really could use more. I suppose I am... Uh, I am capable of waiting a little while longer. Um, do I want a Diplo power or money? Diplo power, please. You're right. This is going well. 18 Diplotech. And next level, we'll be improving our ships again. Okay, not much to be done about that. Constantly at speed 4. How about Mung Yang? Oh, right, I should have been... Mm, and the cause are done. I should have been fabricating claims on Mung Yang as well. Don't have the free diplomat. Conquer Algeria. I could get the bonus diplomat from here. No, no, it's not a good idea. 
not worth spending the admin points. So, do I attack or do I wait for more claims? How long has my truce against Vagina gone? 85, that is close. 86. Hmm. I could just attack them. No, 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 let's start with Yarkand. I think I'll just uh, start constructing another claim and then attack. Skilled Diplomat, Diplo Relations or Free Diplo Power? Okay, um, I'm at 7 Diplo Relations, so... This would, for 10 years, give me one bonus point, which is 120 Diplo points in total, which is better. It's not an immediate gain, but it is a bigger gain. Okay. Fabricate another one against the Arkand. And then declare war. Hmm... Declare war. Need to wait until the 5th of May. This will be quick and easy. Uh, conquest and... Sure. Oh, Bengal. Are you allied with anyone else by now? Delhi and Malwa. Oh, I could fight at Delhi again. Do I want to fight Delhi again? I don't think I do. No, no. Let's not call them an belligerent. I suppose I could take some more land, but I don't have the claims. Let me see how many claims I have on Delhi. I have one. If I fabricate another one... Oh, maybe if I fabricate it on a very expensive... Oh, no, I'm overthinking this. Never mind. Let's just declare war on Yarkand. And then not co anyone. Here we go. And now we have the free diplomats, so I will fabricate claims everywhere. And Vajrayanaga. Yeah, here we go. Hello, Yarkand. One, two. Yeah, this is an invasion. Ottoman invasion of Yarkand. Um, I don't. I have no need. Okay, I, I will. I will enter a royal marriage. Increased air chance can sometimes be useful. Yeah, right. Advance to next provinces. This will be extremely quick and easy. So, how about Bengal? Oh, I forgot to re, re enable the force. Of course, I did. Okay. This is going quickly. And you three have no orders. Right, take everything. Just take everything. It's gonna be quick. They took the province, but I don't think they will be able to... Um... Oh, they reinforced the garrison while the battle was taking place. I didn't know that could happen. So it will only take a moment to besiege. And uh, now, you should be advancing as well, and you should be advancing towards um, this place. Okay. City of Hotan. Cool. That was quick for a capital. And more fabrications. And Orissa is being fabricated on, and so is Vagina Guy in Delhi. Mongyang next. Fabricate claims on Mongyang. Yeah, I do need to move there. Lost the Cardinal, which does not uh, really bother me. Uh, right, and you go north. So... Okay, the recording broke again, and now I think I found the problem. Um, but it is time to end the episode anyway. So in the next one we will finish off the war with Yarkand. And that will mostly be it. We'll finish it off, hope that our queen dies, and if she doesn't, we'll conquer Vajanaga next. A little bit more of Vajanaga. This time, stuff we have claims on, not just the coast. Okay, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time soon. Goodbye.